Dear Pixie, you asked us about alien abductions. This is a complicated question that has multi-layers to its responses from us. For you are grouping together several different and some quite unrelated series of experiences and events into the one heading of alien abduction. There is indeed that which we would feel the word abduction to be appropriate, but only to the few minority of cases. Most of these experiences, which occur on many different levels, we would refer more appropriately to as visitation displacement. We wish to alleviate fear and worries from you, as always, and we tell you now that if you keep your consciousness in a state of bliss-charged love, joy, happiness, confidence and upliftment, you rise above the consciousness levels where lower density beings inhabit. We would like to inform you now that some of you, those we call light workers and starseeds, already have a frequency that is above the lower vibratory beings who you would refer to as extraterrestrial. And those that do these abductions within the third density shall not enter your reality once you move your consciousness field above that which they exist on. Now, we must choose our words carefully here. Let us liken this to a situation where two parents are wishing to speak of a subject they do not wish the child to know about, and the child is in the room. The parents will speak in code. We shall do the same here, for we can only communicate with those who decode our words. But know this, that which we would feel the word abduction is appropriate for, are mostly carried out within third density by third density occupants. These are events of the lower and darker frequencies, just like other unrelated events. Raise your consciousness away from the frequencies that reside on this level and you shall be immune from experiencing that of which we speak. Now that which we would call visitation displacement is entirely different. In many of these cases, although you may feel you are not a willing participant, we can tell you that on some level, which is beyond your understanding at the present point in your existence, you were in agreement to these displacements. It is impossible and completely against the laws of the universe, the very physics of the universe, for you not to have been in agreement. Because of this agreement, there will always have been an exchange, and that which you shall have received in third density existence will be vast growth and learning. You are amongst the first to have made friends with the star visitors to your planet. Know that you are in control of these visitation displacement experiences, and whilst they are not all of the higher light, some most definitely are, yet others are not. But we can tell you that those not of the higher light are also not of the negative and the dark. These beings of which we speak, which many of you know as greys, have neither polarised negative or positive in the way that you know it. They do polarise, but it is of a different nature to yours. So from your perspective, perhaps it would be best to say they are neutral. But within this neutrality, they do not intend to cause fear and harm. They do not understand these feelings within you, but they are vastly intelligent. And when they realize they are causing fear within you, they are compelled to take steps to alleviate this. However, they do not consciously project the love and compassion that you know and feel. Therefore, they are seen by many of you as negative and that to be feared. Well, the minority are, as in all cases, within all races, below seventh density. But the majority do not have the intent to cause you fear, and often they do not understand your fear. From their perspective, you agreed to these displacements only yesterday. 
They then do not understand why you resist so violently when the displacement experience is entered. Yet they are learning of this, of the differences between you in space, time, density and emotion, just as you are learning of this. This agreement we speak of was made by yourself, not by another on your behalf, as is the case with the lower density abductions. There will always be benefit to this type of displacement, even if it does not appear so at the time. We are unable to give straight talking facts about this subject and again we stress that alien abduction is an umbrella term for several different and often unrelated experiences. The reason we cannot give straight talking facts are many, but one reason is that this is beyond your comprehension and understanding. Although there are some of you who do have a high level of understanding and we commend you for your vigilant research and spiritual discipline if you do have this understanding. Know it is you we send much light and protection for the coming ascension for those who have this understanding are valuable beyond belief. You are the forerunners and the teachers for the others to follow. You shall be the masters here on earth and are the first wave, so to speak. But we must continue speaking in metaphoric, coded terms to explain what we are able to. All we can say is regarding these that you call abductions, all is not as it seems to be. You are able to take control of these experiences. Take control of experiences in your waking lives, in your astral journeying and in your dreams. And so then shall you take control in these experiences. Consider the word displacement. Think on the fact that linear time does not exist in reality only when encased within third density. The star visitors involved within the displacement are not from places so far away that you might think. Look closer to home, but look beyond linear time when doing so. Look to the psychological and biological workings of your own bodies and think beyond linear time. Third dimensional thinking will not deliver answers on what we speak here. One must think way out of the box. We are not able to deliver hard facts that we know you would wish for, but we can deliver the tools you need to control these experiences. Therefore, you can choose now within your third density incarnation if you would like to participate within a displacement or not despite the agreement having been in place. You can still change this now within your third density experience. But first, you must learn the difference between abduction and displacement.